Introduction to Insect Pests and Diseases At the end of this lesson, you will be able to describe insect pests, categorize various insect pests, explain the diseases caused by insect pests. History witnessed a sudden shift in the habitat of people surrounding the regions of the state of Kansas in the year 1875. The reason was that a vast land of food crops were destroyed leading to food scarcity. Surprisingly, none of them could even imagine that such a vast destruction was caused by a small flying grasshopper, otherwise known as locust. The crops required to meet the needs of the people and livestock were ruined to barren fields within a matter of hour. As a single unit, the grasshopper was harmless and didn't cause much effect. But when the population was vast, the effects were beyond limits. Moreover, the neighboring state like Nebraska was also affected by these insects. Eventually, the year came to be known as the year of the locust. Moving forward, a similar kind of incident happened in Palestine in 1915, when a plague of locusts devoured almost all the vegetative areas. Disgracefully, in 1958, 40 billion insects ate nearly 80,000 tons of food grains in Ethiopia, which was sufficient to feed 40,000 people for a year. Wasn't it shocking to know the history of locusts and their devastating disaster, which is being an alarming factor even today? These tiny insects called by the name locusts falls under the category of insect pests. In this lesson, we shall be learning about insect pests and the diseases caused by these organisms. Pest generally refers to any organism that is harmful to health and properties including crop and livestock. The word pest is derived from the Latin word pestis, meaning plague. One of the morphological classifications of pest is insect pests. Insect pests are those that multiply rapidly and form a huge population causing economic loss to crops and other properties. In other terms, they serve as a nuisance or major health hazard to humans and livestock. The birth rate of insect pests is influenced by several factors, such as the weather, the food quality that the insects rely on, and the degree of crowding of a particular species. Increase in temperature up to the thermal optima level accelerates the metabolic rate of insects, thereby increasing the birth rate. Death rate of insect pests is influenced by climate and diseases or natural enemies. Crowding of insect pests may lead to starvation or cannibalism. Crowding may also tend the insects to migrate from one place to another, thereby reducing the number of individuals in a particular region. Moving on, let us learn the various categories of insect pests. Insect pests are classified into various types based on the occurrence or association with crop, the seasonality, the level of infestation and the severity of damage. Let us learn each classification in detail. Based on the occurrence or association with crop, insect pests are classified as regular pests, occasional pests. Regular pests are those which are found more frequently in a particular type of crop. For example, chili thrips, brinjal fruit borer. Occasional pests. Contrary to the regular pests, occasional pests do not affect a crop regularly and are not associated with any particular crop. For instance, rice case worm, mango stem borer. On the basis of seasonality, Insect pests are classified as seasonal pests, persistent pests, sporadic pests. Seasonal pests. These are insects that appear at a particular season or a specific period in a year. For instance, red hairy caterpillars found on groundnut plants occur mostly in the month of June or July. Likewise, rice grasshoppers appear mostly between June and July. Persistent pests. These are pests that remain on a crop all through the entire year. They are difficult to be controlled 
and are not active all through the year. Their resting period is spent either on the soil or on the host plant. Some of the examples of persistent pests are scales, mealy bugs, chili thrips. Sporadic pests. These are insects that occur in patches at regular intervals or in specific isolated places. For example, nettle grub. Based on level of infestation, pests are classified as epidemic pests and endemic pests. Epidemic pests. These pests occur in abundance at a particular time or season over a locality and lead to severe destruction. For example, rice hespa, rice leaf roller. Endemic pests. These insects cause infestation at regular basis and are confined mostly to a particular area or locality. Some of the examples of endemic pests are red hairy caterpillar and mango stem borers. Based on the severity of damage caused on plants, the pests are classified as negligible pests, minor pests, major pests. Pests that cause less than 5% loss in yield are stated as negligible pests. Example, ants. Insects that normally cause a loss ranging from 5 to 10% are considered as minor pests. Examples, dusky cotton by, ash weevils. Insects that cause a loss of 10% or more, in general, are regarded as major pests. Example, cotton jacids. Key pests. These are the most serious pests that can cause major loss to the crops. Example, cotton ball worm. Now, let us discuss some of the major pests based on their eating habits. Defoliators. These insects have biting chewing mouth part and they feed on leaves. Some of the examples are grasshoppers, beetles and caterpillars. Leaf feeding caterpillars are commonly found in some parts of Thailand and Australia. Examples long end leaf eating looper, European chaffer beetle, brown tussock caterpillar, borers. They have strong mandible mouth parts that are capable of making holes into the stem twigs, roots, fruits and seeds. They are commonly called as trunk borers, seed borers, twig borers, fruit borers, stem borers and shoot borers. Fruit borers are commonly found in some regions of China and Thailand. Digger wasp creates tunnels on the stem of rose plant. Pill bugs feed on tender hair roots of a plant. Suckers. These insects have piercing and sucking type of mouth parts. Example, stink bugs, aphids, hoppers, scales. Aphids are tiny insect flock, winged or wingless, that affect the tender flower buds and shoots and suck the sap. They are commonly found in Russia and the neighboring states. Example, woolly aphids. Scales are soft bodied insects, mostly blackish or brownish in color and has spine-like outgrowth on their bodies. Raspers. These tiny insects generally scrap the top layer of tissues and suck the sap. Example, thrips and mites. Thrips are commonly found in China. Example, chili thrips. Some of the common plant diseases caused by insects pests are brown blight, anthracnose, parasitic algae. Brown blight. It is a disease caused by fungi infection and is characterized by the changing of leaves from green to brown. Brown blight is commonly found in some regions of China and Thailand. Example, downy blossom blight of lychee, anthracnose. It is also a fungal disease that tends to attack the tissue of the plants. Anthracnose is commonly found in some regions of Guangdong and India. Some of the pathogens that cause anthracnose are Colatotrichum glomerella cingulata, parasitic algae. This is a disease which causes loss of vigor in trees. It is commonly found in some regions of Australia. Cephalurus virescens is one of the pathogens causing parasitic algae in plants and trees. 
commonly infected plants are tea, coffee and coconut. Some of the other plant diseases are rust, type of fungal disease causing powdery tan to rust colored coating on leaves. Galls, they are the swollen masses of abnormal tissues. Leaf blister and curls, this is a type of fungal disease that causes distorted and curled leaves. Black spots, small brownish black spots appear on the leaves which gets enlarged with yellow margins. Molds, they are characterized by a woolly or powdery appearance on the surface of the infected plant parts. Grey mold is commonly seen in many flowers and fruits. Cankers, generally formed on woody stems and characterized by cracks, sunken or raised areas of abnormal or dead tissue. Powdery mildew, it is the formation of white to grayish powdery growth on the surface of leaves. Summary, let us do a recap of what we have learned in this lesson. Insect pests multiply rapidly and build up a huge population, causing economic loss to crops. Insects like grasshopper, having biting chewing mouth part to feed on leaves. Some of the commonly occurring plant diseases are leaf spots, galls, rust, blight, etc.